All right, folks, here it is. It's my very first creation on FC25, and it was a doozy, folks. It is very in detail. Be patient, take a look at him. We got the head shape. We even got his mole, like everything. You got his scar in there. He doesn't really have a scar, but he, he likes to fade his eyebrow. We got the details, man. Look at that. We even have the full look, the kit, the stats, the animations, you know, the works. All right, folks, so for this one, just be patient. It is really crazy how you have to create these players. So just follow the directions. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section and I will gladly help you out in creating this player. It's all gonna be fine. Let's start with the simple stuff. Under the information, first name Mark, last name Bernal, commentary name is in the game. Bernal. Now, kit name, Bernal. He's number 28 from Spain, FC Barcelona. Yes, I do know. He was born in 2007. He's literally in the game, but they won't allow you to set this up. The most you can get is 2005. So it is on May 26. So he is 6'3", 171 pounds. His position is midfielder, defensive, and his foot is left. All right, so before we dive into the D, please make sure you guys subscribe, like, and turn on notifications. It took me forever to make this creation because it is so in-depth. It is crazy the details you can put into this. Anyways, let's get right into it. Now for the avatar, I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter, but that's the one I chose in case it does matter. First thing you wanna do is go to head. Under full head, I clicked on this one. Now with your pad, just click to the right and we got the skin so under the skin tone you want to use that one right there skin number seven with the complexion complexion number six skin surface number 26 freckles none scarring number 20 this is how you get that look in his eyebrow that he has in real life mole number 12 see right there and the second mole is none so nothing here no face makeup, no lip makeup. So far, everything's very simple, very nice, okay? Now for the head. Under forehead, you wanna select 1006. Now obviously on your end, it's not gonna look like this. You see those green little icons? That's because I already applied the advanced instructions. So just make sure you click on forehead. It's actually gonna look like this for you once you select forehead number 1006. And don't worry if your avatar isn't looking like the one that's in the screenshot right there. This was my first time creating this, so I'm kind of just putting together a jigsaw puzzle here. Yours will look like mine at the very end. For the jaw, you want to select 226. For the ears, you want to select number 33. For the cheeks, you want to select number 52. For the chin, you want to select 203. For the neck, you want to select 175. All right, under the face, for the eye color, you want to choose brown. This one right here, second to last from there. Under eyes, you want to select number 52. Under eyebrows, you want to select number 203. Under nose, you want to select 202. And under mouth, you want to select 99. And for teeth, it looks kind of crazy. Every player is going to look crazy, man. Number three. Now, at this moment, if he's not looking anything like him, don't worry. We've only done the basics, guys. Just follow me to the end and you'll get there. Now, for the hair, you want to click on warm black hair. See it right there. For the hairstyle, it's under short number 179 for the eyebrow and facial hair color warm black you can see it right there under eyebrows this one is 201 keep note there is two eyebrows the previous one we already saw it it was 203 this one is 201 you want to use the soft angled and mid arch and facial hair there is none all right, folks, now we're going to do a second layer. It's called blending. We're going to do this for the nose, for the ears, and for the neck. All right, let's start with nose under face, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. 
So earlier under nose, we selected nose number 202. So that's all good, right? Notice how I hover away from it. Nose 202 is still selected, right? So now I've moved over to nose 236. At this moment, I'm going to click the blend button on the lower right hand corner. Now I'm going to move 80% of it to nose 202, which leaves 20% for nose 236 and go ahead and apply that. See how it's created now a custom nose. Now we got to do this for the ears and for the neck. So nose was under face. Now let's go over the head and we're going to go over the ears. Okay, so now for the ears, it's the same thing. Select number 33, which we selected earlier, and you're going to blend that with ear number 203. So it's going to be 60% for ear number 33 and 40% for ear number 203 and accept that. Now for the neck, same thing. Earlier we selected neck number 175. Then you're going to hover over neck 202, click the blend button, and you're going to apply 70% for neck 175 and 30% for neck number 202. And there, we're done with the second layer. Now we're going to go to the, the most advanced sculpting. All right, now go back to the forehead. Under head, you're gonna click on it. You're gonna click Sculpt. And then you're gonna click Advanced Sculpt. So go ahead. We're gonna start with the Skeletal School. Copy those options right there. Then the Skull Crown. Then the Skull Back. Then the Skull Temples. Now, under Skeletal, you're going to switch to flesh. You're going to put the temples, set it up to that. Next, there's nothing under fat. We can finally move on to the next one. I know it's crazy, guys. Now, under jaw, again, select the jaw. Click sculpt. And click advanced sculpt again. We're going to start with the skeletal. So under jaw, those are the options you want to set up inside jaw top the options inside jaw bottom and now we move to flesh here's the jaw now we go to fat so you set that up all right moving on all right so the ears click on the ears Click on Sculpt. Now click on Advanced Sculpt. Now for the ears, copy these options under Skeletal. Then you're going to switch to Flesh, Ear Outside Top. Here is the Ear Outside Middle. Those are the options. Here's the ear outside bottom. And here's the ear inside top. Ear inside bottom. Ear lobe. The ear tragus. I know this is crazy, guys. The fat. Ear outside top. There you go. Ear outside bottom. All right, guys. Now the custom cheeks. So click on the cheeks. Click on sculpt. Click on advanced sculpt. Now under cheeks, you got the options right there. Make sure you set it up like this. From skeletal, now we move over to flesh. Those are the options. Upper outside cheeks. Upper inside eye. Upper inside cheeks. Lower outside cheeks. Lower inside cheeks. Now we move to fat, upper cheeks, lower cheeks, jowl, G 
cheek inside upper, cheek inside lower, temples, All right, moving on to the chin. Click on Sculpt, click on Advanced Sculpt, and here are the options for the chin skeletal, upper chin. Set up those sliders. <laughs> okay, for the flesh, chin cleft. sides now for the fat chin under chin this is crazy you guys okay now the neck there is no advanced sculpting okay all right the face all right so the eyes the advanced features for the eyes so click on sculpt Click on Advanced Sculpt, and we got under eye sockets. The eyes. Now we go to Flesh, Eyelid Folder Center. Eyelid Folder Outer. Eyelid folder inner, eyelid lower center, eyelid lower outer, eyelid lower inner, eyelid upper center, eyelid upper outer. Eyelid upper inner, eye corner outer, eye corner inner. All right. For the fat, eyelid upper, eyelid lower, under eye lower. Now the custom eyebrows, guys. Click on Sculpt, click on Advanced Sculpt. Here's the eyebrows. Eyebrow Center. Eyebrows outside top. The Flesh, Eyebrow Center. Eyebrow Gap. Okay, so nothing for the fat. The nose. Click on sculpt. Click on advanced sculpt. Under the nose. Nose bridge sides. Nose bridge center. Nose bridge upper. Now we go to flesh. Nostril upper, nostril upper outer, nostril upper center, nostril lower, nostril outside outer, nostril outside center. Nose tip upper. Nose tip under. Nose tip lower. Nostril upper. Nostril upper outer. Nostril upper center. lower all right for the fat here's the nose all right
right, folks. We're almost there. The mouth. Custom mouth. Click the triangle for sculpt. Triangle again for advanced sculpt. Here's the mouth. The skeletal. Here's the mouth outside top. The flesh. Mouth corners. Lid gap center. Lip gap sides. Upper lip center. Upper lip top sides. Upper lip top corners. Upper lip bottom center. Upper lip bottom sides. Upper lip fullness. Filtrum. Lower lip fullness. Lower lip top center. Lower lip top sides. Lower lip bottom center. Lower lip bottom sides. This is the craziest one. Lower lip bottom corners. Yeah, and I had to go through all of this, my friends. Mouth corner rogues. Over to the fat, mouth sides. Upper lip. Lower lip. All right, for the crazy teeth, there is no advanced features. All right, we can finally move on to the kids. All right, folks, you still with me? All right, so it's untucked. Sleeves are short. Jersey fit is tight. Now for the boots and accessories, he's wearing the Adidas Predator. So, I mean, he was until he got injured. Poor guy. There. He got injured using those. For the kid socks, he used them on short. For the ankle tape, it's white ankle tape. Nothing for the gloves and wrists. And we move on to animation. So the goal celebration I put on random. The set piece is on default for the free kicks and it's for on default for the penalty kicks. Now his running style, I did change it from the last one. I changed it to Peacock. The last one I gave was, was the Fonz. I mean, it depends, man. It depends on what, what part of the stride he's in. You go with the Fonz or you go with Peacock. I would go with Peacock. I see them running more like that, more often like Peacock, so. All right, folks, finally, we got to the stance. I gave Mark Benal a 70 overall. Now, in FC25, they gave him a 64. In eFootball, he's got a 74, just the basic, the default player in the game. So I decided to take both into account, and I believe this is more accurate than any of the two. So you guys know how I do it, so. If I were you, I'd use these. So attack, the crossing's on 58. Finishing, 57. Heading accuracy, 66. Short passing, 77. Volley's 34. And his weak foot ability is on three. For the defending, the standing tackle is 71 and the sliding tackle is 68. For the skill, the dribbling is 66. The curve, 61. Three kick accuracy, 60. Long passing, 72. Ball control, 75. For the power, the shot power is on 68. Jumping, 63. Stamina, 73. Strength, 75. Long shots, 49. All right, for the movement, accelerations on 63. Sprint speed, 66. Agility, 74. Reactions, 68. And balance, 72. The mentality, the aggression is on 67. 
Interceptions are on 67. Positioning 63. Vision 70. Penalties 40. The goalkeeper settings here you have the diving on 12, handling on 8, kicking 7, positioning 14, and reflexes 5. Thank you so much for making it until the end. A special thanks to the members, and please consider becoming a member yourself. Just check that out in the video description. If you enjoyed this player creation, please leave a like. On the lower left is a playlist for all the players created on FC25. On the lower right is a very new popular online FCB career mode playlist we just started. And on the upper right, we have our epic career mode now on season 3. Please leave a comment to show your appreciation, and I'll see you soon.